It's your boy, Nerdy White Guy. Nerdy, nerdy white guy. I'll put you in a motherfucking coffin, my guy. He's so dope. Nerdy white guy. Nerdy, nerdy white guy. My prayers got answered, dude. <laughs> this, this white dude. Nerdy white guy. Nerdy, nerdy white guy. We're gonna get this shit started, though. Nerdy gang. What's going down, everybody? Bro, I cannot believe all this shit that is going on, right, man? So, the NBA has been suspended till further notice, y'all. One of the guys from Utah Jazz ended up testing positive for the coronavirus. That put everybody into a panic. And, dude, everything is postponed. There is not a game being played. Want to know what else is postponed? Everything. Everything in the state of Washington, if it has anything more than 250 people, it is technically illegal to do right now. Now, I don't know what the hell is going on, but everything is canceled. Concerts. Dude, and this is around the country, around the world. Sporting events, soccer. Dude, everything is being canceled right now. Now, I saw a few clips today. Um, and I want to talk about so I saw one with dr. Drew and dude. I trust dr. Drew man I watch a lot of his shit on your mom's house with uh, Tom Segura. He has a show called uh, Dr. Drew after dark and he's just like a real dude, right? So he goes on there and he just straight chews the media new ass He tells him dude you guys are blowing this way out of proportion Yes, we do got to be vigilant. Yes, you know, you, you should wash your hands. You should do all that shit. But you guys are blowing it way out of proportion. Now, me, I like to go with the scientists and the doctors in this situation. And all the doctors are telling us to just settle down a little bit. Yes, we should. We should be a little bit worried. But it's nothing like what everyone's making it out to be. But everything is canceled. All the schools. And um, so we're in Washington State. So in Snohomish County. King County and Pierce County have been canceled till the end of April. My son is home until the end of April, y'all. So, dude, you can say shit's getting serious. <laughs> but me, dude, it makes me it makes me just like wonder do we have all the facts, all the information? I do not know. Do you know? If you do, man, leave some comments down below. I just feel like there's something they're not telling us. Because um, it's either that or they are really just fear-mongering us. It's one of the two, man. They're either not telling us the full story about how crazy this shit is. Or they're just scaring the shit out of us. Either way, it is a crazy time. The stocks are down. Like, crazy low. Everything is about at their 52-week low. And me, I keep a good eye on the stocks just, you know, because when shit crashes like it is now, I want to invest. There's, I don't know, man. There's not really much more you could say except for this shit is crazy, man. Like, I feel fine. My family feels fine. We're, we're, we're all doing all right, man. There's, there's like a thousand deaths in Italy so far, but that is in people who are 80, 90, 70 years old. They are the older generation and they are a good 10 years on average older than, a, than the United States. So you guys got to keep that in the mind. Their numbers are going to be pretty different from our numbers just because of, uh, the age gap. I don't know what else to say, bro. Just stay healthy, man. You know, stop going crazy, y'all. Like, it is crazy. It, it, you know, but this isn't the first time we've been through something like this. And it's probably not going to be the last. Uh, the thing that makes us super scary is that it attacks the lungs. And, dude, I am a hypochondriac at max peak ask anyone who knows man i always think i got something bro so they're just adding to the list of my fears and shit but when it comes to this one i'm not too worried because i'm never worried of the cold i'm never worried of the flu and i'm not really worried of the coronavirus man and that's about all i have to say about this shit right now it is crazy there's everything's canceled bro everything other countries are 
are stopping like like the mortgage you know they're they're uh, giving them uh, paid off <clears throat> and that's something like if shit keeps on going down the way that it is that's something that we're gonna have to seriously consider um, here in the United States if they make us stay home then how are we gonna pay our bills if they don't you know at least help us by like stopping that for that time being um, I understand uh, the company's position on it but bro if you gonna make us stay home, you gotta start paying these folks, you know, either way or make it so they don't have to pay their bills. Otherwise, everyone's gonna be in debt by the end of this shit. So we can't have that. Um, me, luckily, I work outside and I work away from people. And I can do a lot of my business and my bids over a phone. I just get their address. I can go take some pictures, tell them, hey, it's going to be this. They tell me, then they can pay me through the phone. I don't have to even meet the people, honestly. You know, I usually do. I usually like to knock on the door and say, hey, you know, I'm here, you know, to start working on your lawn. But right now, dude, I'm just strictly doing messages and they're paying me through like Venmo or whatever. So me, I'm all right. I'm pretty sure uh, I'll be all right. Pretty sure my family will be all right. I am a little bit worried about some of the older people in my family. But other than that, man, everything is gravy. I hope all of you guys, you know, stay healthy, stay safe, stay vigilant. But, dude, don't go being hysterical with this shit. It's going to be all right, guys. I love y'all. I just cannot believe the season is over for the NBA, you know, soccer is going to be over. Dude, they're even th talking about canceling the Olympics. Crazy, bro. I don't even know, man. I don't know what's going on. Is this even real life?